Hello, these are the COVID-19 statistics for Richmond-upon-Thames. Over the last seven days, there have been 233 cases of the virus linked to the borough, bringing the total number of cases identified since March 2020 to 1,343. There have been no new deaths directly linked to COVID-19, therefore since February 2020, the total number of deaths stands at 153. 2,990 people have been tested over the last seven days with a positive return rate of 7.3% on those tests. The difference between the number of uh, cases identified and the positive return rate is explained by people being tested more than once. We know that this is a large number of cases and we are doing our best to find out if there are any patterns emerging. What we do know is that there are a significant number of cases which are people who've been tested away from the borough usually in places such as Durham, Manchester or Exeter, and because they have a GP address or home address here in the borough, they are being classed as Richmond cases. We are doing our best to ensure that we can separate those figures to give us a clear understanding of the spread of the virus here in the borough. But we must be under no illusion. These are only part of the numbers. We know that the rise of the virus is commonplace across London and here in the borough. So we need to make sure that we are following all of the rules, including the new guidance, which was announced by the government, which comes into force on Saturday, the 17th of October. Full details of the new guidance can be found on the council website. And we must remember that this new guidance applies to London as a whole. Some people think that Richmond is not included. It is. Richmond upon Thames is a London borough and all London boroughs are included. And we need to make sure that we're following the rules that we're familiar with already. Washing our hands wherever possible, wearing a face mask or covering when travelling on public transport, when in shops, supermarkets and similarly enclosed public spaces, maintaining a social distance of at least two metres and of course observing the rule of six. Please follow the rules and stay healthy. Thank you.